Well, hello Mayfair Bible Church family and friends, Pastor Michael here. And all this past week, we've been enjoying the incredible race VBS Kids Camp, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and now it's Friday. And so tonight is the finale and we wanna invite you to jump into the fun, even if you've not participated over the last several days, bring your kids on out for fun songs, craft games, Bible lessons, the carnival. It's gonna be a blast. And at the end of it, it's gonna be free ice cream for everybody. So the carnival starts tonight at five o'clock to six o'clock. Hey kids, this is your last chance to earn tickets and get your prizes. And then six to 8.30 is the VBS program. We hope you'll come out, invite your friends, your family, to participate in this fun event. Now, this coming Sunday, I'm excited and thankful to the Lord to be back preaching after a couple weeks on vacation in Florida. And so I'm gonna be continuing our series in the parables, those shocking short stories of Jesus. And we're gonna look at a familiar parable, but with a twist. This is the parable of the Pharisee and the publican. And it answers for us how we think about ourselves, how we think about others, and most importantly, how God thinks about us. And ultimately then, who gets in the kingdom? Who gets in God's family? Who's in and who's out? And what's the way in? And so I'm looking forward to this opportunity to gather with you this coming Sunday morning for 1045 worship here in the auditorium where we will sing and pray and rejoice around God's word and lift up praise to our savior, Jesus Christ. Also, back, of course, a couple weeks ago, during our family vacation in Florida, we walked up, actually, I could just say climbed up, the second tallest lighthouse in the nation. And we've done this once before, but this time, I shot some footage of Everlyn and Carson and I trekking up this lighthouse. And I wanna share some of that video with you and a little lesson that the kids and I talked about along the way. So I hope you enjoy these short clips. I will look forward to seeing you this coming Sunday. And now here we're gonna flip to Ponce Inlet, the Ponce de Leon Lighthouse in Florida. Again, see you this Lord's Day. So I gotta say, we're here at the Ponce Inlet Lighthouse, the Ponce Lighthouse, second tallest in the entire nation. And I'm here with my buddy Carson. Sometimes being a lighthouse, getting up to the top of the lighthouse is a lot of work, but Jesus calls us to be the light of the world because he's the light of the world that he says, now you go and bring the light to the world. A city set on a hill cannot be hit. And so we're here, the second tallest lighthouse in America. We're gonna climb all the way to the top, aren't we, Carson? Yeah. And sometimes when Jesus calls us to be the light because we're in well with the power of the Holy Spirit, we go out to bring his light to the world. And guess what? Sometimes it's a lot of work like this, isn't it, Carson? But it's so worth it. It's pretty crazy. All the way up and down the stairs. Hey everybody, we made it to the top. Look at that view. I've got Carson here and my fearless Everlyn. Say hi guys. Jesus said, I am the light of the world. He who follows me will not walk in darkness, but will have the light of life. That's what Jesus said. And then he said, I am the light of the world. And he said, you are the light of the world. The city said that you cannot be hit. Jesus calls us to go out. And it's tough work sometimes, but it's worth it. And we walk in his power and by his grace. Look at this view. Spread the light of Jesus, friends. <laughs> what do you see, Carson? What do you see, buddy? Look at that, there's the pirate ship that you're playing on. Oi, matey! 